Hi guys, it's Sam and I am going to be doing a haul video. I might seem all over the place because I am just have been lately just been running around like a chicken with my head cut off and I'm gonna lower the TV. I forgot to do that. Um I'm play I'm co-planning my friend's bachelorette party and that's coming up really soon. So that's kind of the main reasons why I want to do this video is because there's some things in here that I am going to be using for it. So I wanted to, and if I try to remember what's new that I didn't put into a haul video later on, I'm just gonna forget. So I'm gonna do it now and I'm gonna go through it quickly uh, just because there is a lot of stuff here. The first thing I want to share with you is my new phone so this is the samsung s8 and i did get uh android just because that's just what i've been loving the last several years i did have an iphone before and i love the way that they look but as far as functionality goes i feel like you could do a lot more with the android so that's why i'm sticking with it and i got the s8 um i also got a guard for it. i think this is the i think this is the the Oh my goodness, what do you call that? This is going to be a long video if I can't remember this simple thing. It's the screen protector. And then I did get a case. And it's so pretty. Look at that. I've always wanted one of these. And so this, both these things are from Amazon. Next are the sunglasses from the brand. I want to say Quay, but it might be Key um, from Nordstrom. And I need, I don't need another pair of sunglasses, but these are just, I've always wanted a cat eye and I just love that they have the mirrored lenses and just love these. So I am really excited to have those. Next are, um, this is a sweatshirt from J. Crew, and it is the from the men's section. It's a vintage fleece, but I had gotten one of these, the green ones, if you watched me for... Uh, I might have worn them in a couple of videos. This is amazing. It's I love wearing this, and I'm so glad to have it. I didn't want this color, but it was a gift, so I will take it, and I will love it. Another sweatshirt is from Uniqlo, and this, I just love this dark blue and this pocket right here. So I got that. And then from J. Crew, um, these are inside out, but I've didn't realize that until I started filming this video. Um, these are their ankle jeans or jeggings and I don't have jeans that are this color and I thought this would be a lot of fun. Try to incorporate some color into my wardrobe. So there goes that. Next is several things from Macy's and um, just for everyday wear. I just love t-shirts like this. This is the brand Lucky Lucky Brand and this feels so soft and I love this print. It is so pretty. So I got that and then I'm wearing a Style Co. t-shirt now but this is another one. I just can't get enough of these. They're just so easy to throw on and um, just you don't have to think about it you know when you're picking out your clothes for the day it's that's done um, these are two fun shirts that I'm probably gonna wear for pajamas or for walking a dog this first one is totally me it says allergic to mornings and I totally am it just takes me a long time to get with it so it was tough this is the, this was the first day back and it was I was so glad to be on break but it's tough to go back especially when it was a long one so and then this because I love my girls it says stay golden and then this is the dress that I am 90% sure I'm going to wear to my friend's wedding. The same one that has having the bachelor, bach, bachelorette party. And I know some of you are going to be like, that looks totally white. But it really isn't. And, you know, it's a Sri Lankan wedding. So the bride is going to be wearing red. And that's the one of the main reasons that's like I want to wear this is because I don't think she'll mind. I know it looks kind of white. It's like that. Does it look it's like that, you know, that internet thing. Does the breast, the breast, oh my goodness. Does the dress look blue or gold or white and black or something like that? Or blue and black and white and gold, I think. Um, but it's gorgeous. Oh my goodness. And so I'm 90% sure. Uh, let me know what you guys think about that. There's pink and copper and it's cream. And I don't know, I just think it's so pretty. It has sleeves and it has pockets. I mean... I wish this dress came in a different color, but it didn't. So it's Vince Camuto, and the skirt flares out. 
um, let me, you know what, let me turn this over so you guys can see it. So that's the skirt, and it just fits so well. So, I, I'm going to show you another dress at later on, um, but that's the dress I'm pretty, I'm most likely going to wear. Uh, and then I got this purse, it's by the brand INC. And some of you is like, that is so tacky. But I love it. This material right here, it's not leather. I don't think it's leather. Uh, it feels so luxe and luxurious that I just, I fell in love with it. And, you know, I, you know, as I'm getting a little bit older, I mean, I'm lucky that I get to work with kids and I get away with a lot more things and in terms of what I can wear um but I don't know this is just like really fun kind of reminds me very whimsical unicorn and the strap is nice and the inside of the bag there's a lot of room here which is really important to me because even though I usually wear carry a huge bag when I downsize to a little bag I still want it to have some room uh next is from Old Navy of course gotta get the flip-flops I usually switch them out every year um, because they're not that great material and watch out if you are on like a wet floor. Ooh, you're going to go sliding, but I did get these. And then I also got these linen shorts. They're in the size medium, which I was kind of surprised about, but I think Old Navy runs small. I love this color. Again, I'm trying to add that pop of color into my wardrobe. Um, I'll probably pair this with like a really dark shirt, but I'm trying. So I got that and then... From Amazon, there was this brush set. I was trying to, you know, fulfill that uh, amount for sh free shipping. I don't know how to say this brand. Cuvange, Cuvange makeup brush. And you get 15 pieces. And I'm not going to show you each of them because there is a lot. But, I mean, you just... These are, um, feel super soft and they look really nice. So I'm excited to test these out and try them. Um, I really don't need any more brushes, but I was like, you know what? That it's, I'm always interested in trying new brushes. I just, that's just something that I like. So, um, I got that. And then this something real quick for Ava. This is called a tick key and I didn't take it out yet, but you can see from here, it helps you take off ticks if your dog has them, or I guess if a human has them, um, because humans can get them. And so I got that because I did find a couple ticks. It's only when I go to this one park, so I'm probably not going to take her there until it's winter time. She always gets a tick, so um, I got that. And then for Florida, um, and for my backyard or anywhere that's going to be hot, um, I got this Repel 100 Insect Repellent. Because, you know, Florida, Zika, I just don't want to take any chances. Uh, and then this is the 3M Ultra uh, Ultrathon Insect Repellent Lotion. So I wanted to try both of those. And then here is a bag that I found at TJ Maxx. I am super excited about this bag. Um, it's by the brand Urban Expressions, and I love this color. It's that blush type of color, and it has feet at the bottom, and this braiding right here and it's huge on the inside it does come with a strap and I really like this bag the only thing is I wish the handle the strap is okay the long strap I just wish this was a little bit longer so I could carry it like this if I really wanted to I could but it's very uncomfortable so but I just love this bag and you can't beat the price it was around $30 less than that okay next is let's see um, nothing too important there, multivitamin. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry about that. Hold on one second. Sorry about that. I have allergies really bad, so I think, or I could just be sick again. Who knows? Uh, from Walmart, I got the Milani Prime Perfection, and they had a few to choose from, but I thought I, uh, I would try the hydrating plus pore minimizing. And then I got, this is the last one of the, uh, Wet n Wild mega last liquid cat suits that i wanted and it is the darkest one that they have and it's gothic no goth topic i know not the right not the right time of year for this but i really wanted to uh get this color try it out because i do like those lipsticks a lot um and i think the rest might be for macy's I could be wrong um this is another clutch that i got by the same brand i believe it's inc I don't know what I'm thinking. I mean, I really like this, and 
it comes with a strap uh, a strap if you want to have it and I just think this is super cool and I don't know I'm like a type of person that dresses really boring so I'm trying to dress up myself I guess with the flashy um, purse next is this bathing suit and I love it I love the shape the top here I think it's really flattering and then the back is a zippered um, it is a one piece because that's just what I'm comfortable with I have a little belly so you know I don't want to <clears throat> it all hanging out uh, this is a t-shirt by Vince Camuto it has like paint splotch plus splotches I would call it so love that very very comfortable again this is a jacket by Maison Jewels, and I do have another jacket that looks very similar to this, but that one has holes. Um, this one doesn't. I think this is a great transition coat. Uh, right now, um, I mean, I still have to wear my sort of winter coat today because it was just in the low 50s, but it's starting to get warmer, and I just wanted a coat that was easy to grab. I'm going to put this on the top here. Okay, this is a bomber jacket type of well it's a bomber style type jacket um and it's by the brand sanctuary it, it is gorgeous look at this and you know i this print i feel like is so doable and not scary or anything so i really jumped on the chance to get that and then this is the other dress for the wedding that i was originally going to wear and then i found the other one uh, this is by the brand Kenzie, and I couldn't find this color. I was, um, they had pink, black, and this color, and I chose this one. I just thought it was really pretty, and um, again, it's just flowy, and the other one is a little bit more form-fitting, that dress, but this one is a little bit more flowy, and it does have sleeves, which is something that I'm looking for. I know we're all like kind of self-conscious about one thing on our bodies and I feel like my arms are huge so I wanted to cover that up uh, for the bachelorette party I was thinking of wearing I know you guys this is a theme this color I am obsessed with it so this with like a skirt over it um, so I was thinking about that and then or this off the shoulder but I think it's gonna rain so which is kind of a bummer but this is really pretty as well that's bar three and the other one that I just showed you was Calvin Klein um, I had to get another this is a break from Macy's I had to get another Sonia Keshek eyelash curler I still have it but they don't give you any replacement pads which is a bummer because this is my absolute favorite eyelash curler if you have lashes like mine this is fantastic the only downside is you have to buy the whole thing in order to get the refill which kind of sucks my sister got me these strawberry ice cube tray and then these hair clip things and i think that is all oh you know what two more things and then that is it uh, so these are Rachel Roy safety pin earrings, so I thought that was that was really cool. And the message behind safety pins, I totally with it, so I love that. And then this is by Guess, and I've been loving this geometric, like underneath your shirt where it shows a little bit. I am loving it, and I like this color too. It's kind of like that camel green. Um, so this just looks really pretty, and I gonna try to do it okay so that is the end of the haul I know a lot of stuff going on um, I'm really excited I'm gonna I'm gonna try to film me getting ready for tomorrow uh, on Friday my friend's bachelor party we'll see how that goes I might be pressed for time I don't know um, so I will try to do that and also coming up are my Florida videos which I'm super excited about it's gonna be a mini vacation and I can't wait to share that with you. I hope you guys are all doing well. And let me know what you've been up to. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.